Hey guys, this is Jeremy from Production Den. Today I'm going to be showing you how I record acoustic guitar in FL Studio. So let's jump in. Alright, so let me run you through the different components that I'm using to record the acoustic guitar. I have a small pencil condenser microphone, which is the Octava MK12-01, which is a cardioid or cardoid, however you want to say it, microphone that I sit on a, a small stand, set it up on my desk, and then I have the mic cable running into a uh, microphone preamp, which is the Focusrite ISA-1 microphone preamp. And uh, once I have everything connected up, I'll turn on phantom power because the pencil condenser requires phantom power. And then I have the output of that preamp running into an audio interface into the first channel of the audio interface and I'm not really using the gain or the um, phantom power on the audio interface and that runs into my computer and then I am setting everything up on the FL Studio side which I'll jump in and show you here. I'll jump into the mixer by pressing F9 and that will bring up the mixer window. I'll pick a blank insert or track off of the mixer and I will use this drop down menu on the right side to select input one, which is the audio interface input that the microphone is going into. And then I will name it, I'll press F2 and I'll name it ACG for acoustic guitar. And I'll pick usually like a green color for acoustic guitar. I color code things so it's easy for me to see what instruments or what things are in my projects. And now this channel is set up so that I can record. Um, so I'll come down here and right click on this twice and I'll be able to select the location that I want to record the acoustic guitar part to. So I'll say like ACG, it's called pre-chorus for this one. And so it's armed for recording. Um, the next thing that I'll do is actually get the guitar on and set up in front of the microphone to start playing and making sure that the levels are working correctly. Um, I'm usually looking for them to be pegging somewhere in this like minus 9 to minus 15 range. I know that's a fairly large range, but I just want to make sure that I have a decent signal to work with when I'm actually mixing the song, but making sure that it's not so loud that it's going to be hard to work with and I don't have enough headroom with it. Um, so I'll show you kind of how I dial that in a little bit. I'll overlay maybe a clip of me playing it and then show you kind of where I'm, I'm getting things to hit at on the mixer track. So you should be able to see me strumming the guitar with the microphone, usually pointed around about the 12th fret or so on the guitar, and then dialing in the mic preamp until I'm getting that good strong signal level in between that minus 15, minus nine range. And that's how I set up to record acoustic guitar for my projects. Before I start recording, I make sure that I go up and punch into song mode and that'll record directly to the playlist and then I punch R when I'm ready to actually start recording. And I messed up on this first take so I ended up stopping and doing another take. So when I'm ready to record again, I'll just go ahead and press the R button again and play it all the way through.
Well, hopefully that was helpful for you guys to be able to see the workflow that I use when I record acoustic guitar in FL Studio. If you have any questions about my process or my workflow, just leave those in the comment section below. I'd love to start a conversation there. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and do so. Turn on the notification bell so you can get informed when new videos get posted, and I will see you in the next round.